Welcome to Libertex. The crude oil forecast and targets for February look choppy, despite oil realizing significant gains of close to 50% from its prices back in October of 2020. After a nearly two-week bull run to start the year, WTI crude oil is trading close to pre-pandemic levels, which has been a very positive signal for WTI crude oil traders. However, there are critical market elements that are now casting downward pressure on WTI crude oil prices, leaving many traders wondering if such elements are already baked into the current prices we see now at the end of January near the low 50 levels, or if the bottom is yet to come. In this WTI crude oil price analysis update, going into the month of February, we'll break down the WTI crude oil fundamental and technical analysis and show you the charts towards the end of the video to explore if this is the time to consider establishing positions or to look for alternative entry points. As of January 28th, WTI crude oil prices are hovering slightly up around $53.30 after trading mostly sideways from the start of the year. At this price point, WTI crude is still slightly down from the rally experienced until mid-January. The weakening price levels can be attributed to the market reacting to bearish news developments for commodities in general. COVID continues to be a major pain point for WTI crude prices, and towards the end of January, both China and the UK reported new waves and strains of the virus, responding with tighter restrictions including travel. Furthermore, the new president of the United States, Joe Biden, has put a stop to the Keystone Pipeline project, which had plans to eventually pump over 830,000 barrels of heavy crude from Canada to the US each day. While WTI crude is different, the scenario is not taken as positive news for the industry as a whole. It is possible that these events are already priced into the current levels, but regardless, the current levels are stirring up mixed emotions for WTI traders. On the one hand, the fact that WTI has managed to make a near full circle recovery to levels last seen in January and February before the pandemic is truly remarkable, but the markets realize that normalcy looms further into the horizon. To get a better picture of the WTI crude oil price targets and outlook for February, let's take a closer look at the technical analysis for WTI crude to examine where we have support, resistance, and ultimately price targets. All right, we are now in the Libertex terminal looking at WTI crude, and you can see the upward momentum the commodity has enjoyed to kick off the new year. While WTI is slightly up at the moment, uh, a real breakthrough can only come after it breaks this resistance here at around 54. Failure to do so could push WTI back down. Um, as of January 28th, the time this video is being recorded, many things still could influence movement from here due to what's going on with the COVID vaccine, uh, lockdowns, and many other factors that are going to be at play soon. Another factor that, that may push prices back down uh, is the extent of this rally itself. Um, it's conceivable that some investors believe this run-up was too sharp to warrant the optimism around the current climate for oil, which, as we touched on previously, isn't too great at the moment. However, even with that being said, the month of February could see a wide level of price fluctuations. and There are speculations uh, ranging from around $49 a barrel all the way past $54 a barrel to the low 60s, around $63 a barrel. Um, it's clear that there is this strong resistance here at 54 at the moment. Um, WTI did test this resistance several times, and this is the most significant technical barrier blocking WTI from reaching the highs it experienced last January in the low 60s. What's more realistic, however, uh, is the area around 57 50 cents a barrel. If WTI can manage to break this resistance here at 54, this is the area, area many traders uh, have their sights on as a bullish short to midterm trade. Anything sharper in the short to midterm for February will hinge on positive COVID and vaccine developments, which could ease restrictions and increase growth for the sectors that are reliant on this, such as travel and oil as a result. Conversely, the most critical level of support, if it doesn't manage to break 54, if we do get a fall back down, uh, the most critical level is right around $50.30. 
if this breaks, if this were to break, we can see WTI crude oil falling all the way back to around the $47.50 a barrel area right here. Uh, this would obviously present a more bearish scenario for February, um, but traders will have to assess whether they feel getting in at sub 50 levels, if it fails to break 54 and comes back down, is worth it and weigh the potential upside. So if WTI crude oil is a long hold, that possibility is certainly there. Where do you see WTI crude oil prices going in February? And will you be trading in this month? Let us know your positions and thoughts in the comments and make sure to join our community by hitting the like and subscribe buttons and consider hitting that notification bell to get the latest market updates from your friends here at Libertex. If you're not trading yet or want to switch to a better broker, head over to Libertex.com and get started completely free. As always, we wish you another successful month in the markets. Thanks for watching and see you at Libertex.